Pope Francis describes mercy as the bridge that connects God and man, opening our hearts to a hope of being loved forever despite our sinfulness. Lenten season offers us a time for introspection, to focus on our own soul, our own inner life and our own relationship with God and others. We are called to embody the spirit of humility, dependence and mercy showed in today's readings. By seeking God's mercy with sincerity and by extending mercy to others with love and compassion, we can strive to live out our faith in a way that reflects God's infinite mercy and grace. The Pharisee's self-righteousness blinds him to his own shortcomings, while the tax collector humbly acknowledges his sinfulness and pleads for mercy. He showed us that righteousness comes from recognizing our need for God's mercy and approaching him with a humble and contrite heart. The gospel invites us to cultivate a spirit of humility and to avoid the pitfalls of pride and self-righteousness. When in sincerity and truth we recognize our own need for mercy, we know we need to be merciful to others in our turn. We can show mercy to others by extending kindness, forgiveness, and compassion to those in need. This we can do through acts of charity, offering support and understanding. As we journey to the foot of the cross, let us strive for a humble and contrite heart in our prayers and actions, seeking God's mercy and grace in all aspects of our lives. Oh, my sins, my